Hi everyone, Anthony Fantana here. The internet. <laughs> Hi everyone, Anthony Fantana here. The internet busiest music nerd, and it's time for review the new Nicki Minaj song, "Rich Sex," featuring Lil Wayne. The reason why I'm parodying uh, the the most uh, subscribed uh, channel in the music. Uh, platform of YouTube, if I said it right, of course. <laughs> the reason why I'm parodying him is because Anthony Fantano gave a fucking 10 to Kid See Ghosts by Kanye West and Kid Cudi. Remember that project we reviewed uh, on Friday? Uh, yeah, like I gave it a 9, uh, although the reason why I gave it a 9 because I felt like people will come at me and say that Oh no, like you are biased, you're a Kanye West fan, that's why you're giving it a 10 out of 10 Like, um, you did, you gave it yay 10 out of 10 when it didn't deserve to be 10 out of 10 uh, Like, it was all in my mind, like, uh, okay, are people gonna judge it? So like, I'd give it like 9 out of 10, right? But he uh, was well enough to give it 10 out of 10 and like um, pretty much uh, I mean uh, a lot of people love this record Kids See Ghosts and uh, even though there were some people of course who were disagree uh, overall it gave um, it just was an iconic moment because Anthony Fantano didn't give 10s for uh, albums it's been what three years last time it was uh, Kendrick Lamar's To Pimp a Butterfly so that's very exciting uh, like news for me to be honest i'm really happy <laughs> i'm really happy that my two idols got 10 it's, it means like perfect album score for their um collaborative project now uh moving from that uh, to Nicki minaj she has a new song rich sex featuring lil wayne and a new album uh is coming out queen uh perfect cover and the, what, what I wanted to say is that Nicki Minaj, uh, working with Kanye West, by the way, she had an incredible verse, Monster, uh, on uh, My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, and like, man, I, <laughs> I think like, if Nicki Minaj worked with Kanye West for a little bit again, she could again deliver some of her, some of her best material, uh, I'm, but I'm not sure if uh, it's uh, gonna happen or not, but, man. Kanye can bring out best out of people like Kid Cudi was uh, the best of um, himself in a while but again Nicki Minaj I just want to say thank you for that verse in Monster that was uh, really incredible uh, you really outshined Kanye West and Jay-Z on their song pretty much on Monster and like back then you were not that famous and like and like you know, people just you blew out their minds like pull up in the monster da, na, 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 na. in that line where i mumbled actually she she were mentioning uh m.i.a uh bitch from sri lanka <laughs> it's like fantastic because uh, m.i.a is one of my uh favorite artists as well it's just like you know like the music community is so fantastic so crazy it's just like that's why i love music and it's like uh so much dope things happen uh in music uh and uh, i'm i'm hope i hope that i can sort of give out that happiness that uh, excitement around music to you as well and that's the point of the channel to be honest uh, so uh, this time let's check out new song Rich Sex by Nick Minaj featuring Lil Wayne first reaction let's go full blown run rich breeze yo mula yo okay. yeah. I know what these niggas like and it ain't my charm I ain't stupid, this 250 on my I like money more than dick, nigga, that's a fact You think pussy's everything? Well, let's have a chat Sorry, I just discovered that, uh, like, my speaker, which I was using, was making that weird noises like kind of it was kind of self-rebooting or something so i uh changed it to another speaker of mine i have <laughs> down there so uh, let's continue listening yeah, and if you met if you notice it has a lot more bass to it Put your money where your mouth at, that's some lipstick. That's 
Let's fuck on the money before we contact That's what this shit Forgot to close the Boy drop I don't know man, it's for now it's just like it's pretty mediocre to be honest. That's why I'm kinda I was pretty much messing around this reaction like because it doesn't really captivate my attention. Um I liked Chandi and Barbie things later. Uh, at those times I also had to um listen to this songs more to kind of like it more uh and f like as of today let's say yeah i can put uh, body things and enjoy it like i was i was listening to it quite a while before this uh kanye west ease and season started i was listening to body things and enjoying it um chan lee not so much but i still liked it like the beat was cool yeah it was uh, it was pretty nice but um, it took time to get used to, uh, and like for me, at the beginning it was like a throwaway song, sort of like eh, I'm just gonna release it, and, like because not really, like it didn't seem like she put a lot of effort, effort, and here unfortunately it's still the same thing, like it still seems like a hey, just let's get a decent beat, um, and and do something about it, um. Sonically, it's just like wasn't that really pleasing beat. I know that uh, to construct that beat, it took like it took a while to put that psychedelic piano. You know, like dun, dun, boom, boom, dun, dun, boom, boom. <laughs> it's like it's like that. But then it's just like I don't know. For me, at least, I don't know. Maybe for you, it's like dope beat and it's crazy, it's fantastic. But for me, it's just a regular. Uh, it's okay. Uh, whatever you know and for me Nicki Minaj performance was just average like uh, I know she can do better um, but she's kind of playing it safe like to her own strength what she can do uh, and nothing is wrong about it it's just like there were much better performances than this one uh, and again as I said it's just it's an okay performance it was, it was nothing crazy and Lil Wayne I don't know man like Lil Wayne, I hope one day he will come back to his like 2010 version. Overall, yeah, I, I'm, I'm not really satisfied, at least for now. Of course, I will listen to it more, and of course, when this, uh, when this <laughs> project <laughs> Queen drops, we will get much more sense of what's going on, and like, I feel like I will like this song more. It will flow much better with all of the rest songs. But I just hope that like Nicki Minaj's album will not flop because this I, I really care about this woman. Um, even though it doesn't sound like like it <laughs> from this review, I really like Nicki Minaj. Uh, my um, like album, I really loved the last album. From 2014, the Pink Print was a really dope album. I was listening to it a lot. Plus, uh, for her older songs from 2012, 11, her hits like Starships, Pound the Alarm, uh, freaking what? From all their discography, uh, Fly featuring Rihanna, uh, Eminem, the song, um, what was the name? Uh, like the song Kill, uh, Roman's Revenge yeah it's like much more great songs she had in the past it's just gosh like <laughs> I hope that she she will live up to it again you know Anaconda of course I forgot about that song um, Star, uh, Pills and Portions uh, anyway I just I just don't want to be disappointed and I hope that this 4 year wait of the new album will be worth it, that's that's what I'm hoping for. What do you think about this release, Rich Sex featuring Lil Wayne, uh, did you, you like it? Uh, if you don't like it, tell me your opinion. Uh, I, I want to pull up a poll, uh, yeah, <laughs> there, there you go, please answer and also still write the comment. Uh, I want to know your opinion about it uh, and do you like Nicki Minaj overall, do you like her songs and are you excited for this new project Queen which is coming out, um, which is dropping in August uh, 
15, I believe. She said, you know, August, somewhere in August. Alright. Hit the like button if you like this video, subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you guys in the next ones. Bye. Pull up in a monster, automobile gangster. With a